Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Let's Play Hearts of Iron 4. Kaiser against Russia. Let's continue on from last time off. So, it's still a nightmare. Like, it, it still sucks a lot. <laughs> Blue Army don't need to be all the way up here. Like, the fact that Class of the Reichsback event, as far as I can tell, is just not in the game anymore is such a massive, massive killer for us. Retro line out like this. Because Austria just has so many men. They've got so many troops that... I'm trying to, like, trying to think, like, what we can do. Like, maybe navally invade Bulgaria? Like, we can't really assist Greece too much. I actually don't even know if we have a boat. We have one boat around here. There's no way we can navally invade in, in, from that direction. That's not going to happen. Guys here, you're in circle, that's fine. Can I afford more units? The answer is still no. Can I put any more units in this army? Afghanistan, you got any more troops for me to use? Serbia, Mania, Greece wouldn't give me anything, which you know fair enough. Ron's got one more unit. Okay, well we'll bring one more man over. And one more unit. Who's a better general? Right now, you are 6453. Or, okay, so once Transamir is dead, which if I can just take, if I can just take Vladivostok, will be soon. I can then move all these units over to deal with this situation, which is a nightmare. Like, it, it sucks. <laughs> it's really bad. You guys are still making maneuvers. Maybe send tanks in or something like that. We got Vienna. Like, we've taken one major Austrian city. And I'm assuming you're going to... I'm assuming you're going to collapse 20%. War support right now is at 92. And I think we need to get him down to, like, in the 40s in order to actually have any meaningful... Um, like, yeah. Be expert for you. Infantry expert for you. Give you infantry expert as well. You guys aren't doing too much. I'm trying to think, what do we do with you in uh, in Prussia? Hey, Vladivostok fell. That that has to be transit more dead, right? Forty thousand guns. Okay, actually, that that does. That actually is very important. Take all states, thank you. Which then means that these units are going to immediately deploy over here. Don't even have nails, air spirit you're already here. Got a thousand fighters. You guys don't need to be here. Bomb Poland. You have too many planes in this uh, airfield. That's actually not where I want you to go. I want you to go. I guess here? Kind of? I'll fly you back like this. Any other airports? Yeah, you're too full. I mean, if we can take this airport, we can get planes closer to the front. I have two options. The man Armenia... Let's not attack the Ottoman Empire right now. I just feel like that's not, not not a good choice. Not a good strategy for us. Yeah, we do have DC units. They're making their way back. Are you core? Yeah, you're already core of ours. Excellent. We have some units over here now. I'm gonna bring... All right. 27%? Okay, we're going to bring some, uh, some naval vessels over here. Okay, we also, we, we, we're okay sending the shipping through here now. But all of these boats. Mm -hmm. 
Make your way over to Bari, please. This is because they have so many, so many units. So many freaking troops. I think, like, what can I do? I think you guys right now. Reset your attack plans. But you guys actually aren't even attacking at all. Okay. Yeah, do, do a normal attack. You guys reorganize yourselves. Huh. Get rid of this. Here. Go take Slop. You did lose Danzig. I mean, you guys are feeling somewhat confident with an attack. I'll be honest, I don't, I don't share your optimism. But I think Black Army, which is mostly just motorized, I'm gonna send right here. Yellow Army can probably hold Prussia at least for a little bit. Do you have any more? Um, maybe no more railway guns. How many do we actually have? I think we have like. Got a decent number, I think. I think Red actually might have lost there somehow. You guys aren't doing anything. But you don't feel confident with an attack, so I don't want you to attack if you don't feel good about it. The target Bucharest commence. If you can maybe have, I don't like, I don't think Romania can just spawn event units over there. Is Red, you know what? Red do like a very basic cautious attack. I think, I think I do want them doing a general offensive where we can. We got Vienna's right there. And I would, I would love to have Vienna. Of course, obviously. I mean, I would love to have all these cities under my control. German units over here. You guys, you know, try your best. And are all? No, you're, you're still. How long? Why are you not strategically redeploying? You know how far away the walk from Vladivostok to freaking Moscow is? That'll, take, that'll actually take you forever. We, we don't have that kind of time on our hands. Like, it, it should, we just don't. We just don't. It's like, I don't want to have units over here. Like, the, the fact that these are, like, fucking mountains I hate. Okay, Black Army's on their way. Yellow army. Yellow army, I think I think really you just stay in the fence. And I'm gonna move you over to black. There we go. That's my normal battle plans for now as well. I mean supplies are still okay. There is supply hubs that are just not connected to anything. Kinda funny. Villain is over here, 84%. Villain is starting to slowly live, or not, I was gonna say liberate itself, that's not necessarily true, but. They're getting their territory uh, be taken by the Reich's back. Here comes Black Army. Get 16 ships around here. Where are they coming from? Oh, is this because this is still set to avoid? No, go go through this. Yeah, there you go. Um, aside from that, we don't need to be worried about naval invasion orders over here anymore. Um. <laughs> ah. Ah. 
For pink, purple and exit shouldn't be over here. And red army, once again, I'm going to have you stop attacking. Just, just hold the line where you're at. That, that should be, I think, more than, you know, reasonable. One in Vilnius. Decent amount of enemy units around here. This is all part of the same line. Where are these guys now? They're, st they're still near freaking Manchuria, man. They're still near Manchuria. Okay, we can support the French over there. Another air, we'll take this. Yeah, yellow's just holding on by a freaking thread. How is it? How have the international done like nothing? So that's my question. I do see that. I mean, huh. I say like Albania is kind of just abandoned right now. Five percent superiority. You guys are on your way. But then even even then, I feel like I still would then need another army to reinforce the Albanian front, which I don't I don't fucking have. How many guns? Do we have guns yet? By the way, we have fifty thousand guns. Okay, we do have guns. Um, twenty combat with. Do we have like one that's kind of garbage? Yeah, you're a little bit more garbage. We have twenty four stack of you. Okay, we have enough guns for another 24 sack. Happy to see that. I want you to navally invade Albania when you can. I don't know if that'll allow me to, to invade Albania right away. It would be nice, but... No supplies, huh? The yellow army is also now dead. You need Cohensburg, please. Please take that as quickly as you can. I think you guys actually be very aggressive. Why do I keep defending Vilna so hard? It, like it's, it's Lithuania. You don't gotta worry about Lithuania that much. If I can somehow, like, I want to go back into Poland. Remember when you were almost at Krakow? Those were the times. Those were the days. Now, now look at us. Yeah, thank you. Here are your sets. We on normal for now. In manpower, we're still completely okay. You guys are weak. And then I need you. I shrink past the river. Who owns all this territory? Technically, Germany. If we can push our way into Poland, how many units? I think Poland has a pretty, I say, a pretty big army, but they actually don't. Not really. Okay, Greece is capitulated. I think. I think. That's the first time Greeks actually has died, which I'm surprised by. I really feel like they would have died forever ago, but apparently not. And all of our naval units are now around here. I'm gonna combine all of you. We're still waiting. You know what? Cut some of you off. We have five divisions. Even even if these these all these units from Blue Army die, kind of 
push here. Even if they all die, they are going to distract the Reichs back, which is kind of, that's what I want. That's all I could ask for, you know? Okay, we're pushing down here decently enough. I'm gonna set you guys being careful on the battle plan. You guys no longer attack this direction, because I don't think it makes any more sense for you. Your job is to push from Riga from the south. If that makes any sense. Again, if I let them just take more and more territory, they'll kind of spread their line out thinner and thinner. Whereas my army kind of remains the same, you know, amount of concentrated. Like, maybe it actually makes sense? I don't know. Okay, Albania is dead. Which means that all of you now deploy here. I'm gonna shrink blue line like this, and they're just gonna push here. But I would love to get, that's why I want these 24 units to deploy. I can send them. Do I have military access through you? No. And why does Greece. You guys should not be exiled. But I know the AI will never um, give up that land. Ninety-three here, Red Army, Salzburg. Thing is, like this is all core territory, which means that killing them is just an absolute pain in the ass. Some units are arriving down south now. Is what I want to see. You guys actually have a battle plan? You don't? No, you do. It's down here. But say, say you to be normal. Normal, normal battle plan. You guys are still doing okay. Let's not worry about any of this. Where is your supply hub? It, it's, in, it's in Vienna. We do need Vienna. Supply hub up here, you do. Black army, I need you to invade, let's say, this way. If you can capture a supply hub, that would be quite nice. Light your attention up a little bit. Okay, that will be Vienna falling. You know, and that's not nothing. What do you guys have here? 17. There goes Vienna. I'm going to stretch your line out like this. Red Army, come over here to help support. With Vienna falling, you're still at like 72%. Cool. Put these guys down here. Do you have any... No, they probably can't get anything done. Which is very unfortunate. Do you even think of Lvov yet? I thought the city had already fallen, to be quite honest with you. Okay, you know, Yellow Army actually took back uh, Owensburg, which is more than I would have expected them to do. Like, if you can just, like, defend here. You know, actually, can you capitulate Bulgaria? I, I don't know if they can, but if they could, I don't think you're going to be ready to go. Because once these are connected to the capital, our supplies here are going to look so much better for us. Yeah, are you still very aggressive? Far. Let's go down the regular for now. Is Poland anywhere close to being killed? No. At least not yet. Guys are just, you're not distracting per se, but. No, you just hold it on to them. He's conference. That's, that's Burma. We don't care about Burma. What if we can maybe. He really took the railroad from behind us, huh? 
I, d I don't think... I was going to say, do you think Black Army could maybe victory point rush a little bit for us? Are these motorized divisions, do you have anything slowing you down? No, you, your top speed is 12 kilometers an hour. The thing is pretty good. 87, you guys are okay where you're at. I mean, we are pushing. And it looks like the International is taking back Venice, so that's something. Boy, this 24 stack. Congratulations, welcome to the front. I'm going to immediately send you over to Italy. Paranaval invasion. Let's just say, like, here for now. It's going to take you, I think, forever to get over there. The Costa Rica... Really... Central uh, America. I guess so. you're just by yourself then in your own faction. Okay, so Central America owned Ecuador. I... I... Look, I don't know what's happening over there. And I'm not going to pretend to know. No supply connection to capital. You are still four days away. This invasion plan doesn't make any more sense for you. No divisions here. 24 units here. We did take Lvov. Okay, that's that's something for Poland. For sure. <laughs> oh, this this war this war is some it's it's gotta be one of the messier build freeze we've ever had. How are there 24 divisions? There's 24 divisions? Where are they all? I'll be honest, I'm not really seeing them. Days until you're ready to go. Salzburg's worth three victory points. So it's, it's not really that big of a deal whether or not we have it. Blue Army, you know, you're still holding on. Hundred and fifty two days. Can I pass through here? No. Um, and uh, we don't have any, we really don't have any ports. What a fucking mess, man. What an absolute, what an absolute mess. Ninety percent, ninety one with you. How is the front down here in Albania? I mean, not great, but I think that's kind of to be expected. Like, how are... I just don't understand how the International is doing such a bad job. How many guns do we have now? 47,000? Okay, give me one more 24 unit. I, where are we going to put them? I'm not too sure quite yet. Maybe, maybe, I, maybe I guess Poland? If we can kill, like, again, we just want to kill these countries. Obvi obviously. But. Okay, Mamel, we're going to. Leave, I think. <laughs> I mean, I, got, we, I was going to say we can send him here, but even then, I don't know if that's actually, like, a great idea. I mean, the supply routes are still okay. You are worth five victory points. Try another push into Vilnius. If you push me. Hindenburg right now is the capital of Germany. Because, I mean, I want to kill Poland. Yeah. 
nine against you. Bring me out the New England Division then here. Just to do maybe like a little bit more damage. Just on the off chance that maybe we could uh, get some good work here done. Go to go here and then go to Budapest. Just take the fastest way possible. Vlad's Warsaw Krakow. I think we can think those cities Poland should give up. At least that's kind of my hope. Five, you guys should be well defended, and then yeah, just keep on driving towards Budapest line we're going to shrink or not shrink we're going to extend you into this area here black army we're going to shrink you then uh i guess it's like a teal color turquoise once you're here i want you to actually drive on this railroad going towards the greb Blue army is completely encircled. Kind of what I expected, to be honest. This for now. You know, it would be nice to take Budapest. We've taken, we've taken like a lot of their major cities. You know, we've got. I mean, Prague actually is pretty far behind up the front line now, which is nice. I'm not, I'm not like worried that we're going to lose the war. I'm, I'm fairly confident that in the end we will win. But it, it, it's just going to be, it's going to be just so messy getting there. But I think for right now, it's going to be a good time for us to end this episode. Thanks everybody for watching my Anthony. If you enjoyed, run a thumbs up. Not enjoy, click thumbs down. You want to see more? Subscribe and goodbye.